I have known a lot of great doctors in my lifetime. Doctors that, male and female, have given their lives to the betterment of people's lives by seeking to make them better. Many of these doctors have told me that they simply witness the activity of healing taking place, that healing takes place within a person. They aid and they help this along. I pray that every person that needs healing will have a wonderful doctor, but I also pray that they will realize that they're connected with the great healer, God. In Jeremiah 30, verse 17, it says, I will restore health to you, and your wounds I will heal. I've had a small cut before, and I've been marveled looking at it and realizing that the healing activity of God is taking place. I'm being restored and I'm being renewed as that cut heals. When you're facing a health challenge, one of the most important steps to take in healing is first attitude toward that healing. Your positive attitude and your outlook on life. Your mind is renewed as you cease any negative ideas and you allow the Christ to be born anew in you in mind and in body through healing thoughts. You picture your body in your meditations and prayers as whole and well. You see your body this way and spiritually this fortifies and feeds your body to accept the healing that is now present. You know that the Christ is working through you and you allow divine life to regenerate in you, to create new in you, to move in you, and to heal you. And as you do so, your body is renewed. The light of Christ illumines you and the healing energy courses through your body. Your mind and body are in tune with the Christ, and your way is made clear for divine life to fill your body with, with an, a new vibrant strength. And you find that you're whole, you're well, and you're renewed. God bless you. My dear friend, twice a year we come to you with a message saying that if you've never given to positive Christianity, prayerfully consider giving and supporting this work. This work is unique. I know of no other like it. It offers free prayer and daily inspiration and sermons to people and churches of every faith. And you can support this work with just a few dollars, especially if you do so reoccurringly. You can go to www.positivechristianity.org and then down at the very bottom you'll see the donation area that is totally secure. Put in your information in your credit card or send us your gift at post office box 7993 Woodlands, Texas 77380. Thank you for this consideration. It is a work that is entirely supported by the viewers and the readers. God bless you.